What's happening, YouTube? Back in the day, Gamer here. I want to thank you for joining me as I host another weekly retro challenge. Before we jump into it, let's cover last week's winners of Zombies Ate My Neighbors, brought to you by Captain Algebra. In fourth place, we had the Jab Jab Show. Third place was Wastapo. Second place was your host, Captain Algebra. And last week's winner was Captain Saver. I took fifth place, but let's just forget right all about that. This week, I'm bringing to you F-Zero on the Super Nintendo, because it's Super Nintendo month. I want to start off by saying, I think I hate this game. I haven't been this mad doing anything in a long time. I don't know what it is, but this game just makes me crazy. When the other cars hit you, and jam you into the wall, and spin you going the other way, it's totally not fair. I can't take it. I don't even want to play this game anymore. But let's cover the rules and get it over with. Hopefully you do better than I will. So we're going to play the first track. We're going to play it on beginner. And you need to use the blue car. We're going to see who has the fastest time. Doesn't matter if you come in first, second, third, whatever. Obviously if you have the fastest time, you're going to be in first anyhow. But add up the times for all five tracks on the first course. And whoever has the fastest time wins. All right, here we go, YouTubers. Selecting Grand Prix. You're going to pick the blue car because that's the car I want everybody to use to keep it the same. And you're going to choose the Night League on beginner class. Yes, that is easy. Up with this game, we're going to have no problem with it. But this is supposed to be fun for all. It's not going to be the biggest speed run in the world or anything like that. Just want anybody watching this video that has this game that wants to join in to be able to. You know, when I was playing on the harder classes, I wasn't having fun. Some of the time I didn't have fun playing on this beginner class. Like I said, I didn't grow up with this game. I only bought it recently. I hadn't played it that much. It is fun to just toss in, but man, just some of the stuff is just brutal, unfair. It made me so mad. Wasn't having much fun at all. So I'm just going to go ahead and skip to the end of this first board here because it's the first board. Well, there we go, people. I didn't do that good. I decided to try some experimenting, which was stupid. Because why would you do that when it's go time? I think I've done worse before, but 22109. I see anybody who's ever played this game before being under 220. I was originally thinking tacking on a ride or two not be able to use those repair strips but on the fourth board you have no choice but to use them and on the fifth board I can't imagine possibly even beating the board without using them because you got to bounce off so many walls because of all the 90 degree corners but whatever it's all about having fun so we're on the final lap of the second board you didn't need to see me go through it because I'm not pulling out any cool tricks that you need to know about. Like I said, I'm not even that good at this game, but I'm doing I'm doing better on the second board than I was on the first board. Now I decided to bring you another racing game, because two weeks ago I hosted and we played RC Pro-Am. Not sure why, partly because my Super Nintendo collection consists a lot of RPGs, and you can't do a challenge like this with RPGs. Well, there we go. I was lucky enough to finish in first place again. Let's check out these times. Not terribly good. 228.77. I still see people being able to break 220 on that. Now, this board, I hate. <laughs> Even on easy or beginner, I had trouble completing this course. Let's look. Oh, here we go. Yeah, those first two boards, no problem. Hey, this game's fun. Get into this, the third board here and the fourth board. Oh, man. My blood pressure is boiling. Hey! There you go. Look at that. I couldn't even beat the... Ugh! I couldn't even beat the third board. By the way... You're not allowed to lose or die. <sighs> okay, deep breaths. 
Okay, now that I've counted backwards from ten and poured myself a drink, I'm not having a temper tantrum anymore. It's not that big of a deal, it's just a game. I'm not even mad anymore. See? Totally calm. Well, there you go. I don't have a score because I didn't even get halfway through this circuit. But you're going to do better, I know it. Because that's about as bad as you can do. So good luck to everyone. Thanks for watching. I hope you enjoy this more than I did. And stay tuned for next week when Captain Algebra hosts another Super Nintendo game. But as usual, like, comment, subscribe, all that jazz. And until next week, YouTube, keep it retro!